What is up everybody? It's Misa Z here coming at you with a video for today. And for today's video, what it's going to be about is how to record both your Xbox One as well as your PS4 screens for your um, for YouTube or just to get clips off of them, etc. Now, what you're going to want to do is you're going to go to twitch.com, the live streaming website, yes. And you're going to need an account for this. And after you sign in and get your account, what you're going to do is go up to the top right up here where my mouse is currently and click that. Then you're going to work your way down to where it says video manager and click on that and wait for it to load. Now this screen should pop up and what you're going to do is you're going to go to the left and see where it says your name. You want to click the little wrench by your name and then it should go to the settings on your account. Now what you want to do is you want to go to channel and video settings so go ahead and click that and there should be a list of different things. You're going to want to go down to near the middle and should say archive broadcast. Go ahead and check that. Mine is personally already checked for the sake of this video but it should be like an empty box just like the one below it. So you should just be able to click that and you're good. So now we're going to go switch over to the Xbox slash PS4 and I'll show you what to do from there. Now once you've loaded up your Xbox One or PS4, I personally am on Xbox One, you're going to want to go over to your store. Then you want to go over to your apps. Now this might be different for um, PS4, but all you're doing is downloading Twitch. So go to your apps and go ahead and click, um, type in Twitch and this should pop up. Now all you're going to have to do is download the Twitch app, and I personally already have it downloaded, so after that you're going to be good. Um, so you want to go to the game that you want to record, uh, and my, me personally, for the sake of this video, I'm going to be doing Fallout 4, so I'm going to load that up, and say you want to make a video on the settlement that you did, all you want to do is go down to Snap an App. Now on uh, PS4, all you want to do is open Twitch, and if you are prompted to sign in, um, go ahead and sign in. Now simply all you're going to do is go down to broadcast, go ahead and click that, and a little broadcast menu should appear. Uh, there you go. I put mine as just recording, that way, you know, if anyone's viewing, they know I'm just recording. Um, and simply just start the broadcast. Now once it is started broadcasting, um, you can hit click the home button, go to your dashboard, click unsnap, load back into the game, and as you can see on the bottom it says broadcasting, no viewers and go ahead and click whatever it is to unpause your game and begin recording. Um, this is my settlement in Fallout 4, so, you know, do whatever commentary you guys want and once you are done recording, simply um, stop Twitch on PS4, but as for Xbox One, snap, go down to Twitch and it should give you an option to stop broadcast. And there you go, your broadcast has ended, thank you for your broadcasting. Now after this, all you want to do is go back to your computer now simply just load up Twitch and go to your um, profile and then there should be like a little option to go to your um, videos that you just broadcasted. Um, right down there you can see my clip is right there, 18 seconds long, just recording. Go ahead and click on that. And right here you have the option of a little video you can play to view what was recorded. Now in order to export this to your computer, go ahead and click on the little gear icon down at the bottom and click export as you can see right there. Now you're going to be uploading this to YouTube so make sure you put it on private. Um, now that's a, now that's a mistake that I made. It uh, I accidentally put it on public, so if any of you guys saw it, I'm sorry. Um, now all you're going to do is go to a different tab and go to your YouTube account, load that up, and wait for the clip to upload. This can take a while, and there's no way to check how far it's done. So um, just wait for it to upload. You know, check back on your YouTube account every once in a while, and it should be there shortly. Now your video should have been uploaded shortly. And um, as you can see, it is the exact video that I recorded. And simply all you need to do to keep this is go to a website called keepvid.com. Um, as you can see right there, now go back to your YouTube, copy the URL, and simply go to the keepvid.com and paste the URL into the little bar there and click the download button. And the video should download immediately to your, to your computer. And that's all you need to know, really. Um, after that, it's whatever editing software you want to use and add whatever commentary you want to use. And that is pretty much what I have for the video today. If you have any questions, comment down below. I really hope this video helped you guys. So please like, subscribe, share this video with your friends. And as always, peace out, everybody.